He says, I saw uh, Benjamin Albright mention Dan Quinn a few times a while back. Something about ties to Peyton. Please tell me no. Give me Kellen Moore, Mike McDaniel, Brian Dayball, or a sleeper, Brian Callahan, whose father was one of the most venerated O-line coaches and, of course, former Raiders head coach. You know, Mike McDaniel is a name we don't talk about enough, but I, 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 Mike McDaniel is the uh, – he's a sleeper option, but I just don't know that he's had enough experience under his belt in the right. big boy – responsibilities to all of a sudden be a head coach. But then again, I thought the same about Zach Taylor and look what he's doing. Cause he got the quarterback, right? Zach Taylor's name was mud in Cincinnati that first year. Then he got the quarterback and they backed off. And then of course he gets hurt. And now this year, Zach Taylor, cause he's got the quarterback again, things are okay. But Zach, your thoughts to this, what you've heard and what you could maybe intuit from the whole Dan Quinn ties to Peyton, all that. Well, I respect the hell out of Albright. I don't really think this list is uh, – it, it will be accurate come January when the Broncos are on the search for Vic Fangio's successor. I, I tend to think that they're going to go for an offensive guy. You have to you know, look at the results now. Vance Joseph, defensive guy. Vic Fangio, defensive guy. You, gotta, got, you kind of have to find the next offensive mind. And that list also included names like Jason Garrett, Jonathan Gannon. I mean, these are retreads to the max – I've heard Mike Zimmer, too. I want no nothing to do with him. Hard pass. Uh, Dan Quinn is just like Vic Fangio. Horrible head coach. Really good defensive coordinator. The Broncos game notwithstanding, doing a lot of good in Dallas right now. I will take Helen Moore easy, but that might be the most obvious choice here. And very rarely, Chad, does the obvious actually turn out in reality. But those are our guys, the three that they named. And I'll be happy with any single one of them. But George Payton might want a season guy. He might want to get his Mike McCarthy, so to speak.